Alright, so this video I'm gonna be calling out those employed sons of bitches. That's right. Which means I'm calling out the whole entire world but myself on this one. Oh, we must be in Salem because I think a luncheon's gonna happen. Oh, what's that? I hear people marching up the road with pitchforks and uh, torches and all that jazz. Bring it on. I think there's a few desperados out in the street with tumbleweed looking to do a quick draw right now. It's alright. You employed people are a trick. You're 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 very contradicting about your lifestyle. Now when you when you employ people see an unemployed person, you wanna bash them, you wanna talk shit about them, you wanna talk shit to them. Some people even get their asses beat because they're unemployed. And then these are the same motherfuckers who have jobs and, you know, I think they're hot shit just because they make money. And when they go home, they bitch to whoever about how shitty their life is. They can't afford nothing. Uh, you know, about how many mouths they gotta feed or the electric bill or fuel or router, what's a router? This shit. They all they bitch about all this shit. Well, dude, you just beat this you just beat this homeless man who has no job to a bloody pulp. Then you go home and whine, cry, bitch and moan, drink a cup of scotch about how your life sucks. You got a job, you stupid son bitch. It it seems like to me most people with jobs are very very ungrateful they're ungrateful because they have a job and in most places these days it's really hard to get a job and they forget how hard it was to get that job to begin with they forget that not everyone is like them not everyone is special like them they're able to get a job just like flick at a wrist blink of an eye Twitch of a dick. And then, uh... They don't, they don't realize how much money can... Money doesn't necessarily... I can't, I can't say that. Because some, with some people, money does buy happiness. But the moral of that whole thing is... Money isn't meant to buy you happiness. It's like... Happiness should just come on its own terms, not from buying it, is what that means. Or something along those lines. I'm not a fucking expert on happiness. Look at me. Do I look like I'm fucking happy? <laughs> but, you know, they, they they get everything they can. They, they're able to pay at least some of their bills. At least they have bills to pay. Unemployed people, they don't have any bills. People, you know, employed people look at that like, they have no responsibilities. That's why they, you know, they don't care. They're enjoying the fact that they're stuck at home all the whole time, miserable, choking on their own vomit because they're so sick of themselves and their own filth and their bullshit. Blah 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 fucking blah. Why would anyone wish this upon themselves? Why would anyone want to be unemployed? Look at the pros and then look at the cons. Well, the pros are pretty fucking obvious. The cons. None. None. Oh, what? It's summer vacation all year round? No. No. We get bullied, we get beaten down, we get spit on, we get treated like shit because we're not making money. Everyone wants to judge us. It's almost as if everyone has like unemployed vision. They see someone who's unemployed and are like, fuck with them. Fuck with them. And then you got these motherfuckers who don't even deserve to be on welfare. They use it. They have like four kids. 
for no fucking reason. It's called keep your legs closed or you wear protection, get the pill, do something. Do something. Don't bring a child onto this planet because you don't feel like thinking things over, being responsible, and then you use that child to fucking... I, 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 now this is going into a whole different fucking thing, but welfare was originally made for people in need. In need. It's not all unemployed people's faults that some unemployed people think being unemployed is about a year-round summer vacation where they can just live off the state. And then, and then people think you can just keep going back to welfare. Say so you get kicked off welfare. Because you're not doing something you're not supposed to do or whatever. You know, you get kicked off and you come back, you get kicked off, you get back. They, everyone thinks it's like unlimited. Motherfucker, please, no! Eventually they cut your ass off. They look at that shit, they see your name come up like a ninth time, and they're like, no, don't help them out. Don't help them out. Employed people, give it a fucking rest. Stop treating unemployed people like shit and maybe help them get a job. And instead of bitching at them, bitching, pissing, moaning, shitting all over their lives, why don't you help them get a fucking job? Stop bitching about your fucking job too, because you don't realize how good your life is. At least, you, you know, you're talking shit about the person who can't get one job, but at least you have one job. You can't be happy about that. And then some people have two jobs. Three jobs. And you're still unhappy? And on top of that shit, this is the same motherfucker who's banging his secretary. Motherfucker. You got two or three jobs. You bang your... Or one really, really good job. You bang your secretary on the side. And you got your fucking beautiful wife or whoever the fuck it is at home. Doing everything else for you. Holding on the home front. And all you want to do is cry, bitch, piss, and moan about how shitty your fucking life is? Give me a motherfucking break, you pussy boy. Quit your job tonight. Quit your job tonight. See how good your life is from there on out. See how happy it is. See how fucking blissful. How much, you know, it's nirvana not making any fucking money. Go ahead. Go ahead. See how happy your fucking life is. And then maybe, maybe then you'll remember where the fuck you came from. Because not everyone is born on this planet with a fucking job. Not everyone is Bill Gates. As far as I'm concerned, that motherfucker came out of like a fucking RAM memory card thing or whatever the fuck that shit is that are PCs. I don't know. I'm not a PC guy. I'm a gun guy. A woman guy. That's the shit I know about. I know how to cook too. Throw it down. I know that shit about art and all that too, but computers? I don't fucking know. But there's not too much more I have to say about that. Stop your bitching. Be glad you got the money. Stop crying about it. You can have my life. You can have the guy, next unemployed guy or girl that's, you know, you can have their fucking life. And then, and then someone can come over and stomp you down. Drag you across the fucking mud. Make you feel and look like shit. Then you can eat out of the fucking garbage. Go ahead, you stupid motherfucker. You won't. You won't quit your job for nothing. Because you know for a fact that we're right. You know for a fact that I'm right. You couldn't even fucking handle it. And I don't blame you. Because having a job these days, or ever, any day and age, is one of the greatest things you can ever fucking have. You have a job, you're set. Everyone loves you. Everyone wants to be your friend. People want to fucking be with you. It's all about the fucking money. Sad. Buy my fucking happiness.